need computer training for a group or office, contact us today to get a free demo of our training at www.teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise dash licensing. One of the great features of OneNote is the ability to share content with other users. Many people can be accessing the same notebook, updating information, and adding content with everything saved automatically. Sharing a notebook for use by multiple people involves saving the notebook to a location that can be accessed by others. To create a new notebook to share, click the File tab in the ribbon to enter Backstage View. Then click on the New command on the left menu. In the New Notebook section, you can click SkyDrive, labeled Web in 2010, to save the notebook to the SkyDrive of your Windows Live account if you have one. Now if you don't have a Windows Live account, you can click the link that appears to sign up for one. It is a free account. If you save the notebook to your SkyDrive, you can then access it from any computer with an internet connection, just like all your other SkyDrive documents. Now instead of saving the notebook to the web, you could also elect to save it to a network location by clicking Computer in the New Notebook section, and then clicking the Create in a Different Folder link at the bottom of the area to the right. Next, navigate to the location and then enter a name in the Name text box. When you're ready, then you can go ahead and just click Create. Now, OneNote will then display a message to you that the notebook has been created and is accessible to anyone with access to that network location. You may get the dialog box also asking you if you wish to email a notification of the creation of the notebook. At that point, you could select Email a link and your default email client will launch to send an email with a link to the notebook. Now once the shared notebook is created, it will appear in the notebook dropdown with a very small icon next to its name indicating that the notebook is shared and will be synchronized. And you'll see that little sync icon next to the notebook icon. So now, as users access the notebook, changes they make will automatically be saved. But you can also share an existing notebook. Let's go ahead and take a look at that. Go back to our work notebook here. With the notebook open, you can click the File tab in the ribbon to enter Backstage View, and then click the Share command in the menu at the left. You can click the link to email others about this notebook, then, right here, which will launch your email client where you can send an email with the notebook details for sharing. And you'll see that if we open that up right here. So you could enter who that's to and add any notes that you want to send that. You can click the Share with an Online Meeting option if you are subscribed to any online meetings that support OneNote sharing. Let's look at that. So we'll go back here and we'll click share again and there's the share with an online meeting. Now finally you can also elect to share the notebook with others by copying it to a SkyDrive account or to Microsoft SharePoint if you use that software by clicking the Copy This Notebook to SkyDrive or SharePoint link at the bottom. And that will open a web page from Microsoft with further instructions on how to copy the notebook to either of those two locations. Like what you see? Get a free demo of our training for groups of five or more at www.teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise licensing.